By default, the block editor comes with a full set of font sizes, small, medium, large, and extra large. There's also an icon that allows you to switch to custom font sizes. Now this feature can make your theme go slightly off piste, which might not be ideal, especially if you've carefully crafted a theme with beautiful typography. And we can disable this setting in theme.json, but how do we find it? So as in the previous video, you could go to the theme.json reference in the WP includes folder, but there is another way. So I've created a functions.php file in my theme and I'm assigning a variable called settings equal to an internal WordPress function called WP get global settings. Now this function does take optional parameters, but if left empty, it will return all the settings. Here I'm just using var dump to output the variable, then using WP die to stop WordPress from running any further. Now save the functions.php file, pop back to the browser and refresh the page. If we scroll all the way down to typography, you'll notice a reference to custom font size, which is set to true by default. Now, if you only want to find the typography settings, pop back to the functions.php file and in the WP get global settings, this time add a parameter as an array and set the array to typography. Now save the functions.php file, go back to the browser, refresh the page. Now we only get the typography settings. So we know what to set, we can disable this logic in our functions.php file. Now go to your theme.json file and under settings and typography, then nested in typography set custom font size equal to false. Save the file, go back to the browser and refresh the page. You'll now notice you no longer have the ability to add custom font sizes. But if you want your theme to allow custom font sizes, say for instance, just the headings, no problem. You can isolate that block and reactivate the custom font size. So go back to the theme.json file under settings, add blocks, then core forward slash heading, create an object within that for typography and nest custom font size and set that to true. Save your theme.json file, back to the browser and refresh the page. And now when you select the heading, you can adjust the custom font size. You'll notice that the paragraph block remains unchanged. And that's how you can enable and disable custom font sizes. If you found this helpful, you can show your appreciation by clicking that like button. And feel free to subscribe for more tips like this.